Hey everyone! Welcome to another episode of Minecraft Let's Play. Well, I just uh, got done kind of organizing some of the stuff that I got uh, from the nether trip. Uh, took a little while to get back, but I made it. Uh, I had to energize myself by taking some food in. And the good news is, got some good stuff on the way back. So I later found out that those things that were spawning were actually, you know, the blaze and they, they, I was fortunate enough to kill a few. Uh, and just as I was about to, uh, leave, uh, the location when I was getting to the top, uh, where I entered, I realized, uh, that, uh, there was some nether wart at the base uh, of the steps. So I was able to gather some stuff, and as you can see, I've modified the kind of, uh, you know, wizardry room or enchantment room, and uh, was able to haul. I, I had this cauldron from beforehand, and I was able to get the water. So I read that I need a decent supply of water for brewing potions, and I think I have all the ingredients uh, to start brewing some cool stuff. Uh, I left some glass in here because yeah I think I'm gonna need some uh, and uh, I got more in here I was brewing more so let's see where did I put it so over over time these are some of the things I've been able to gather and I think I've got a decent start so let's let's get this show on the road uh, let's see what I need so the first thing I need is I need to, to brew potions I need these blaze rods um, I guess four is enough for now. Not sure uh, how many I'll need, but I think it's one of the ingredients in terms of building um, this this stand here. So I'm gonna put that in there, and then I think I need some cobblestone. One, two, and then here. This gives me a brewing stand. So that's it. I don't want to use this because I know I need this for brewing. So I'm just gonna just take this stand and place it right about here so let's see what does this give me brewing stand okay that seems to be one of the ingredients uh, so a brewing stand and then I have a cauldron got some water in here and uh, I think I need some glass bottles. So, because this seems like, uh, you know, so let's see what I need for a glass bottle. Let me go back to the chest here and see what I need. So, I'm going to just type glass. So, I need, okay, I've got some glass. So, let me go get the glass. And I've got a decent chunk here. I had decent sand, so I was able to cook this stuff up. Um, glass. Okay, one. That should be enough, no? Nine. I think nine is good. So what do I do now? So I'm gonna... Five. And then one here, and then one here. And this goes back here, I guess. Okay, and what is this? I think this is... Does this go here? No. What do I need to do with the blaze rod? I know it's an ingredient. Let me see. What does this give me? This looks like that thing. So it gives me two. So that's good enough. I'm going to just use that for now. Because I need to go back and get more stuff. So cool. So those bottles are now showing up. So if I put this here and okay, so I think I've got everything, but what goes in here? What are some of the ingredients I need? So I'm going to look it up. I've got, I made some notes here and it seems like I need a nether wart. So, and you know, as I've been playing and I've been learning, about this stuff I didn't realize but you know 
some of these ingredients, uh, it was too early for me. I, I didn't even realize the value. So I was just using them for making, you know, kind of decorative rocks and, and Netherwort was one of them. So, so let's see, let's go back here. I've got a decent chunk and I think I'm going to start growing them. I know there's a trick to these. I was able to get the sand on which they were growing. I guess it's called soul sand or well, something like that. So I need to first make a base. So if I put this here, is that what I need to do? Or is that not what I need to do? Is it doing something? I don't see it doing anything. Okay. Do I need water? I don't know. So let's see. Uh, I've got the... I'm taking a look at my notes here. It says I need a glass. I have the blaze powder. And... Do I need to put... What else do I need to put in here? Isn't this enough? Okay. I guess not. So do I need water? Let's see. Let's see if I can get some water here. Okay. So let's, let me try that out. Uh, see if... Maybe I need water in all of these. So good thing I did. Nope. One more. Let's see. So I need that. And put that back in there. And what else? Do I have any more water in there? I do. Well, this is going to... Good thing I put this repository in here. Okay. So this is good for three bottles. Now I need to create the base of this. There we go. There we go. Oh, wow. So, this seems to be working. It's pretty exciting stuff. Finally, been able to get some uh, Awkward Potion. Okay, so this is Awkward Potion. I have... Let's start out with these. I wonder, can I stack these? And can I stack the awkward potions? Nope, I can't. So I am going to, let me just make a chest for these potions here. So I think this is the base ingredient. And then let's see what else I need. So going through my notes, it seems, so this is one of the base ingredients and let's see what I can do. Um, Okay. I wonder what this gives me. So, I've got some... Uh, there's one with sugar. So, let's try that one. So, if I take this... Would that help? I don't know. This is all new to me. I feel a bit lost here. Okay. So, I have sugar. Let me get that sugar. Okay, let me get one of those bottles and let's see what that does. So if, do I need to take it here? I guess I do. So how does this work? Oh, I first need to convert this to sugar. So one, two, three. Let's try that for now. Um, is this how it works? Do I use this? Nope. Maybe I need to go back to the brewing stand. So let's try that. So I'm going to go back here. Put one of these. And then... Let's see. What What's that going to give me? Okay. And what is that? Potion of Swiftness. 
Cool. Okay, what else can I use as a secondary ingredient? So it seems like, hmm. So what if I, I've got some redstone. I like to experiment here. So I'm gonna keep this one here and I'll see if we can get some redstone. So I've got this and can I do this? Does this work? So if the redstone is put here, oh yeah. Uh, I think this is going to make the effects last longer. So I've got a decent amount. I want to try one more thing. I've got some glowstone. So definitely I need to start growing another wart in a lot more abundance. I didn't realize this is what its use was, you know, and that's the thing. Uh, okay, so this is cool. Now I'm going to go and... Yeah, as I was saying, I didn't realize that this is what this thing would be used for, and this is how handy it is to build a, a base potion. In the beginning, I, you know, when I went to the nether, um, I just thought it was, you know, some useless plant. Anyway, uh, so let's go here. What does this do? Anything? I guess that's as far as I can take it. So, Potion of Swiftness. So, should we take it out for a test run? Okay, I'm gonna take it out for a test run. And I, I kind of added some more rooms here. I actually, let me show you this. I didn't, I don't think I showed you guys this. Uh, off camera, I don't wanna bore you with all the, you know, the boring stuff, but I, this is gonna be my bedroom. I just put three beds in here. Now that I have plenty of sheep, there's no shortage of wool, and no shortage of making a bed. But anyway, let's go out and uh, let's give this a shot. So I'm going to let's see swiftness. Is there any? Oh yeah, this thing is going fast. Cool. Wonder how long it lasts. So this is awesome. This is pretty cool. Oh, now I think I've got. Uh, let me see. If I if I run at this speed, how much do I hurt myself? I still hurt myself. So it's not immune to hurting. It's just, you know, with these potions brewing this stuff, um, it, it gives me these capabilities. So now I've got some cool, uh, you know, I, I can build some additional cool capabilities. So what else? Now I'm going to read up on more types of, uh, you know, potions I can brew, but uh, this is going to be exciting and I want to try out all of them, but that's going to take a little while. So let's go back in the house. Let's see if I can do, you know, sprint around the place and how fast it allows me to, oops. Okay, I'm just going to do a round around the house. So let's see. So as you can see, there's kind of this staircase, this overhang. Uh, that goes around the place. So, feels like I am going faster and this thing will last me for a little bit. Well, this is exciting stuff. Can't wait to see what other stuff I can brew. Um, awesome. Yeah, and uh, I added this carpet, this, this nether rack. Uh, so I've got tons of bricks now, nether bricks and, and the fun stuff. And now I've Nether wart, so I can continue building some more red stone, uh, red nether, red nether rack stone bricks. I didn't realize, you know, that's how you, uh, those are some of the additional, uh, what do you call it, uses, is was for beautification. Uh, I know I used it before, but I wasn't sure what that plant was. Now, you know, kind of feel a little, uh, silly knowing that I can use this stuff for brewing potions. Um, but I guess I didn't have the blaze rod, so anyway. So this is cool, 
And I wonder how long this blaze thing lasts. So we'll see. We'll see. I need to go in there and I need to kind of brew a lot more potions. So let's see. Let's kind of see where we're at. We've got water. We've got a cauldron. We've got this. I wonder if I need more than one. Three should be enough. Uh, three potions. So I don't want to waste... I want to keep the blaze rods here. Uh, this is These are very va valuable things. So I'm just going to keep the ingredients here, not move this around. I might take some because I want to grow some nether wart. Uh, actually, that's too much too. I want to see what I can do. And let's put this back. And I've got this ender pearl. I've got a couple of them. There's another one I have. I don't know where I put it. But uh, I want to try the gold ingots because I know you can have glistening melon. And I think there's glistening carrot or golden carrots. Um, or glistering melon, I should say, and golden carrots. So I'm going to try those recipes out as well. But, uh, you know, this has been really cool. Um, I'm not sure if there are other kind of things. I've got an enchantment table. I've got now a brewing station. Um, the castle is coming together. Um, now I can build more of these kind of stones. Uh, as before, I was limited to the um, ingredients I had. And uh, let's just take a look from up here. This is... I'm really happy. And um, in the next episode, let's see what we end up doing, actually. Let's see what else we can do uh, by, uh, you know, using these potions. We might end up going out and exploring and seeing what kind of powers it gives us. So... Um, that's it for today, and uh, I'll see you all in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out. Thanks, everyone. Bye.